Mahindra Satyam has built an innovative telematic service delivery framework which basically covers three broader modules. One we start with a typical telematics application which is used for vehicle tracking and monitoring. The second application which can be used by this framework is for the security and surveillance. For the larger customer players who has got a large number of fleet operators managing their warehouses can use the service delivery framework which can give them the benefits in terms of cost and revenue savings. And third application which can use this framework is typically on the fixed assets which can be used for the remote monitoring of the applications or it can also be extended to the larger framework such as smart grid applications where you can also integrate with the microgrid optimization of a large campuses or you want to globally monitor the energy consumption pattern this service delivery framework of Mahindra Satyam can be highly used of. When I get into the telematics framework, it has got uh, six or seven broad components or modules in it. Let me start with a simple thing. Whether you have a one or two vehicles or you have a large fleet of oper you know, vehicles in operations, doesn't matter. The service delivery framework has been architected in such a way that it is loosely coupled and tightly architected. That means most of the functionalities and modules that have been developed are architected independently. So tomorrow if you want to modify this framework as per the need of your business rules and customization within 15 to 20 percent of the customization effort this framework can be launched. So now let me get into the vehicle tracking applications. It has got the first module as a vehicle settings. The second module is the driver settings. The third module talks about the real time tracking of the vehicles. Fourth module highlights the history tracking. The fifth module talks about the alerts. When I say alerts, it has got a speed alert. When I say speed alerts, it's an over speed alert or under speed alerts. It has also got about the stop alert and the start alerts. Then the fourth broad component which has been fairly used across vehicle tracking is the geofence alerts. So when the driver is not permitted to go inside a building, is violates, you will get an alert. The architecture is you know, structured in such a way that it covers four broad segments. So it has got a call center integration module. So if anybody wants to book a vehicle, they can call a toll free number and the call lands into this STF framework where the logistics operator can view the call request and assign the vehicles for the pickup or the drop. That is the first component. The second component is the dispatching module. So they have a set of vehicles which is pre-assigned to this framework where they can choose for based on the order type and they can dispatch it to the customer location for execution. And the third module where you talk about a report generation module. So it is like a decision support system for the CEOs and CXOs where they want to know the performance of the driver, the performance of the vehicle, the output of the system and what is the revenue that they have generated. These four modules in integratedly put it into the service delivery framework and we have hosted this application in a cloud environment. So what benefit the end customer derives? Number one, Mahindra Satyam provides an end-to-end -end services. That means right from the order booking, scheduling, dispatching, monitoring and reporting is what provided. And they are going to consume this pattern not in a traditional uh, you know like a fixed bit model where you have to buy the application host it maintain it we are hosted in a cloud so pay per usage so as they are going to consume this application as they are going to monitor their set of vehicles they are going to pay only for that so whatever the savings the large customers are able to save in terms of capex can be diverted to their operational expenditures or the further investments in their IT. So that is a direct savings which you are bringing to the customer. The third part, we have also built this framework with the prognostic elements of alerts which can be used for your warranty management system, which can be used for the maintenance schedule of vehicles, which proactively alert what is the readiness or the health of each of the vehicle because the hardware which has been used into the service delivery framework is indigenously designed by Mahindra Satyam. It has got two components. One is a simple AVLT box which has got a GPS connection, it has got a communication module, it has got an inbuilt power and memory which can use just for tracking alerts and so on. There is an high-end module which has been defined in the hardware which has got a components like a CAN bus interface which will take all the health parameters of the vehicle say for example the fuel level, tire pressure, seat belt warning, drowsiness detection system, lane violation systems and all these things. 
if i want to use this high end hardware to the commercial vehicles for example the third party logistics company or a large supply chain management companies who has got a fleet of trucks we can integrate a load cell into this scan bus you can have a rear view camera into this so whatever the high end gadgets including the infotainment part of it can be seamlessly integrated into this indigenous hardware the entire component hardware services framework and the managed services are provided on pay per usage model so the consumer is going to pay for the level of the services that is going to take it from mahindra satyam in a nutshell i will say the three benefits what my customer is going to have number one it's an end to end service framework which a company can use irrespective of the fleet size so whether you are a small and medium uh, logistics player who has got only 5 to 10 vehicles or you are a large scale supply chain management and you know freight forwarder you got 10000 vehicles across globally for both the customers this framework can provide the value added services and number three having said that it has got a web based application it has been hosted in a cloud we have also extended this application to the mobility devices so you have a smartphones in android os or you have an ipad with apple os or you have a windows phones where you want to see it up we have launched this application commercially under the brand name mahindra intelligent locator.com so if you go to www.milocator.com we will provide a guest user access you can go into our application see the feature register your assert track them off take their reports get the warnings and submit up